rugged. Awesome. Rap, 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 rap. Hello, hello, hello. My name is Troy Hill. This is Troy Hill Talks of a few thoughts and opinions of Masters of the Universe Revelation and the similarities of the original Transformer movie. Um, I've often compared the two, um, obviously because of the fact of killing off the main character, one of the characters that we've all known and loved for several years. I mean, similar in that regard. And then with just um, watching Clownfish TV today and they're talking about Andra potentially wielding the sword of power, she's going to say, by the power of Grayskull, and she's going to have the power. This is exactly the Transformer movie. You're basically taking, you're killing off a main character everybody loves and replacing that character with some of a character that nobody gives a shit about. Transformers, perfect example, is Hot Rod. No one cared about Hot Rod. Hot Rod became Rodimus Prime. People were pissed. Now you're trying to say if Clownfish is right and they, they, happen, to, they happen to kind of be like the Nostradamus of C TV series right now, if they have her, if they have Andra end up wielding this sword and becoming the next He-Man, a.k.a. Andrus, man or warrior, it is the exact same damn thing. I, will, I mean, what do you guys think? Is, is there a similarity or am I like just looking into it too much? Let me know. Please like, please comment, please subscribe. And, you know, if you agree, that's great. If you don't, that's fine also. I mean, we appreciate the positive feedback and, you know, with the negative feedback's okay too. Because sometimes you guys might be just right and it might be enough just to make me sit up there and think and reevaluate things and do a little more research. So we encourage all feedback and comments. Um, just let us know what you think. But that's just a quick thought. Do you guys think that the Transformer movie and this new He-Man series is basically the same damn thing, especially if Andra ends up wielding the sword in part two? Let us know what you think. See you next time here. Troy Hill Talks. Yeah.